I'm Liam Morrison and today I'm going to expose some golf cheats and, are you ready? There's a gadget in here, what's made for golf cheats, would you believe that? Right, so golf mates, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I am Liam from the Golf Mates. We do some crazy videos. A lot of stuff is just normal golfers on the golf course having a laugh. We have an 80 year old man who's probably one of the best golfers on YouTube. Anyway, back to this video. I purchased this online because I seen it and I could not believe my eyes. It's called a Mulligan Genie, the first cheating device in golf. Some people are buying this. Strap this to your leg and press this. Look, strap. Cover up, tap, ball drops out. Let's have a bit of experiment with this, shall we? Lads, have you got a minute? Yeah. Well, have you been playing golf? Uh, well, like, yeah. Have you ever come across any cheats? Have you been playing with your mates and you think, hey, you've been cheating or anything like that? A few times, yeah. Honestly? Well, just when he's like, they say they found the ball. What do you mean? You so, obviously, I have no ball here, no, so if I did that. Yeah. I went like that and my ball's here, what do you think? How did that get there? Because yeah. I've not moved my hands, have I? No. Uh, in your pocket. Look at this bad boy. It's called a... Well, it's a cheating... Is that, it? Is that it? <laughs> Yeah, you, you press that. <laughs> Found it! People use that? Well, it, it's on sale, so I might do the video like saying people are actually going to... Would you buy one for a laugh or is this shocking? I think it's shocking, but then someone said it's funny. If you're playing with the lads, what do you think? Uh, or have you got a mate who'd use one of them? <laughs> probably have actually two of them. I've got you, Chops. Yeah, I'll probably have his own. <laughs> That's a good lockdown beard. I think you're ready for hairdressers like me, <laughs> Sat. What about you? Have you got any hair cut while yeah, you're I'm hiding it? Myself. Oh, you've got loads, haven't you? So you wouldn't use that or would you, you wouldn't buy one? <laughs> so when you say, have you come across any cheats then? Yeah. And what have they done? Have you caught them or not? Well, like putting the ball down? Yeah. No, they just, just kind of let it go. They're really caught. But you're kind of annoyed, the ball's yeah, in the crap there, and it's yeah, just all. Yeah. Out, yeah. <laughs> What's your name, lad? Uh, Norman. Norman? Adam. Adam? Norman? Yeah. I bet you're best off with that name by your <laughs> mum and dad, aren't you? Yeah. Right, Norm, cheers. <laughs> cheers, lads. Right, what's your name? Dalton. Dalton, have you come across any cheats in golf? Yeah, myself. <laughs> have you? Well, you might be interested in this. Watch this. Look at this, huh? You ready? You watching? <laughs> you like that? Yeah, I do. Too, Didn't move yeah. my hands. Did not move oh, my hands. Have you seen this? Now, this is not a tag. It's called a mulligan genie, you tap it on here, <laughs> give it a press. <laughs> Would you buy one for the crack? I don't think you're a cheat, you're just having a laugh yeah, there, aren't you? I don't you? know cheat, man, to be fair. I would buy Do one you know anyone one. who would? I would buy one for a laugh, to be fair, because they didn't know what it was, but they already know what it is now, don't they? Yeah, would you... Have you ever come across a cheat, though, playing with one, like one of your lads or anything? Mm, yeah. What have they done? Uh, lost balls always, and they all seem to find them in the woods and stuff, and that's been on the fairway. Happens a lot. When you know it should be gone? Yeah, when it's definitely gone. Huh? Yeah, we call that the Paul Daniels, that. You know it's gone next minute, it's there. Yeah, yeah. Dalton, thank you very much. Always, pal. So, the Mulligan Genie. Shocking device. Honestly, I hope no golf mates buys this, honestly. Right, for the rest of the video, what we're going to do is give you a little inkling to keep an eye in case you spot a golf cheat, because they do some naughty things, these golf cheats, and I'm going to show you my top five cheats I've seen in my lifetime. So, golf mates, here we go, my top five. This is number five of what you've got to watch for cheats, is this, the hurry muff. So we've got my playing partners over there, they can't see everything. So they can't see the kind of line I've got here. Now, this is horrendous, this. So what's the hurry muff? Is this. And we'll have a bit of that. I wouldn't be able to do that shot if I were on that line, would I? Come on, par it, I've won the money, and I'm going to be a scratch golfer. Oh, no. Oh, I've gone in the trees. We'll find it, I'm quite sure of it. Come on. Right, golf mates, what you've seen there is this. This one's playing well. This is why I've seen this at Charlton. We've seen this with a, a Cat 1 golfer who never wants his handicap to go up. 
And we've witnessed this because if he would have bogeyed the hole, it would have gone up and he might not have represented a county. So I've just gone in the trees and it's bashed them, bashed them a lot. It's not come back out, so it's in the trees. But this is where number four of the cheats to be aware of, you can call it Paul Daniels, David Copperfield, or the young David Blaine. Yeah, got it, cheers. Probably just chip out. Medicine in it, take it. Right, golf mates, number three is the full house. Yes, you heard that right, the full house. Oh God, uh, I'll set a provision, provisional. Got one here, got one here ready, yep. Tailor made two, bloody hell. Let's go and uh, see if we can find my first. This right near my second anyway, so come on. Let's see if we can find a provisional ball. Right, Joe, found it. I don't know how it's come out, but we'll take a better look. That's my first ball, tailor made two. Oh, hang on. I've just found your other ball, and that's a tailor made two. Is it? It's not mine, that, is it? Yeah, what are you playing at? So there you go, golf mates. That is a full house. That is the people who have a provisional ball ready in the pocket but they identified the same. So we've got two identical balls, TP5, tailor-made two. They might have a dot on it, but they're exactly the same balls. Honestly, I have an experience with that. Keep your eyes open for people who have the provisional balls exactly the same as the first ball. That was number three, full house. Right, what I am going to say, while we're doing this video, I want to hear your story. So if you've been playing with people or witnessed people cheating in golf, Tell me your stories. I'd like to hear them because there might be stuff I'm missing here. Because I've done a couple of these before, but especially with that little thing on your leg, that is a cheat stick. Tell me your stories. Right, golf mates, number two is the Usain Bolt. You've seen this, somebody speeding up ahead, marking the ball, moving away. The playing partners start coming up the hill. And then obviously they do what they're doing on the green. It's this turn here, the cheat, who's done the Usain Bolt. Look, he can roll it in from there. He's gained himself four or five foot. I've seen this happen, but I could not. Let's just say I knew the ball were over here and it got close to the hole, but you can't prove it. But Usain Bolt, number two, that leads me to number one. Now, you've probably got all your own cheat stories and you're probably thinking, what's number one? Well, it's quite easily, isn't it? Golf mates, number one of the worst cheats you've got to look out for. And I mean it, is anybody who's wearing pants on a hot day I might have one of these, a mulligan genie. I have never seen anything like it in my life. What do I think of this? If it weren't plastic, I'll chuck it in the bushes, but I'll put it in the bin. Right, thanks for watching. Listen, comment below, tell me, have I missed any cheats to keep an eye out of? But more importantly, I would love to hear your story. So comment below your stories where you've seen cheats or witnessed cheats and how you've handled it. Because imagine if you've seen someone cheat and you went, excuse me, you just cheated. And he went, no, I've not. And you go, yes, you have. And you're playing with two other people and they didn't see it. Where does it go? It's best to stay away from them people. Right. Thanks for watching. Like the video if you can. Subscribe to be a golf mate. We have loads of fun content. And uh, there's videos every day. So we'll see you tomorrow.